Okay, here we go. This is how you claim a Facebook fan page, or just say a places. Um, see so here, you click on this is your business. And in this case, you say yes, yeah, certify that I'm official representative. Then you fill out the information. Okay, once you fill out the information, it's asking here for a website, which I don't have one yet. Third party validation, so you do a, a search. Which I did already. You see this right here? This Yelp. You take here, you click on it, and then you take this up here and you right click and you copy it. So that shows that this person actually, this address actually exists and that's their reference. So Yelp is perfect. Boom. Okay, from there we continue. And, um, okay. In order for you to claim, you have two options in this case, either email address with the, as it says here, the business email, so it has to be at that place, but if they don't have a website, it's a problem, otherwise you get a utility bill. And that's what we did, so we got a utility bill right here, and um, that's exactly what we're downloading. Then it says submit. Now, obviously, this takes longer, but this is one of the ways to claim it. If, if it was a phone number that was already there, then we said, we'll send you an email to confirm your request to complete. Please allow up to a week for the response, which that kind of sucks, but that's what you can do. So that's one of the ways to claim a um, Google Play, I should say, Facebook Places. It's time consuming, but this is not the only way, but it's one of the ways. We'll do another one. Okay, our client has fun play, um, fun playing parties going on. Now, this is what happens. Right over here, this is a fan page done by one of his former employees. So, because of that, we actually have to come and change this. You can see they haven't been in a year's time. He doesn't have access to it. So, what we're going to have to do is actually make a new one. So, we're going to put, um, we're going to go over and create a page. No, this page in particular will be a local page, and we're going to put the name over here in the top. This is what they'd rather be known as. They want to fill out the information. Okay, this is a mess here. The page is called Fun Play Parties and Play Sets, and then they got Fun Play Parties and Play Sets here, but it spells wrong. And then he wants to be known as uh, Fun Play Parties and Playgrounds. And, um, it's over here spelled as fun place parties and play grout. So, I mean, we we can change this once he gets the log information, but we have a mess right now. In the meantime, what I'll do is I'll just create the page as the way he wants to, with the address and so on and so forth. And um, then we'll take it from there, but um, this is kind of crazy. Okay, we further information, choose category. In this case, it's going to be... I picked attractions and things to do just because this is a place for children to do something. You know, the bounce place, slide place, this is a fun spot, you know. Okay, I'm going to upload an image, do that. Okay, for now, we only have one photo. I'll change that afterwards. This is just to make sure we have something there. Then we will skip here. Claim this page. See, this is where it gets really interesting because the fact of the matter is that this is his phone number. I do certify that I am the person, and then we will continue here. So that's the number that they're calling. Hopefully, he's there.